Good morning guys, so today is Tuesday the 15th of December so it's 10 days until Christmas Day. I can't believe that this year's gone so fast, like me and Adam were talking about New Year's last night and talking about like going out for dinner or something for New Year's and he was like sure that's ages away. I was like Adam it's literally two weeks away. Isn't that so weird? Can you believe it's 2021 in two weeks? No me neither. I am in work today, this is my last week like in work in work of the year I'll, I'll be working from home over Christmas I just thought it would be nice to be at home at Christmas and also it'll be nice to avoid Belfast traffic because it, it is actually starting to get really busy I'm currently trying to paint my nails and as you can see I'm really struggling so if you've been watching my vlogs you'll have, you'll know I'm using the Miley gel nails kit at the minute but then I picked all my nails off yesterday like see when one comes off like there was one and I just don't think I did it right so it was sort of like starting to come off so I picked it off and then not once I'd picked one off I just had to pick them all off I don't know why I do this but I do so I picked them all off yesterday and then I just didn't have time to redo them so I'm using my emergency nail polish that I have in the car to just make my nails look not as disastrous as they currently do so I suppose I'll just concentrate on painting my nails because I'm doing my difficult time and I'm really really struggling with it so I'm going to concentrate on that and I'll catch up with you guys later but I just thought I'd introduce the vlog so yeah happy Tuesday and I'll probably see you guys after work good evening folks it's a good bit later now I've been home for a couple of hours and had dinner and just booked skating so the oh my hands are really dry and look how much hat and cream I've just put on. The uh, ice ball is reopening. Well, it's already reopened. Actually, it reopened on Friday there. So that's very exciting. So it means we can go skating again. It's been a while. It's been a, it's been a long while, actually. So we've booked that for Thursday. So at least that'll be something a little bit more exciting for the vlog rather than literally me sitting in my bedroom for three days in a row. As I said, I put on like my emergency nail polish this morning and it's a disaster so i need to do my nails tonight and also i need to edit a vlog so i've got a lot to do and it's already eight o'clock so i think i'm gonna get on with with some of that i'm going i've been watching hannah morling's week two of vlogmas i'm obsessed with her videos they're so so good like she's just she's just so funny and chatty and like it's just really easy to like watch that sounded really weird but like you know what I mean. It's just an easy like YouTuber to whose videos are just easy to watch. That's what I was trying to say. I think I'm going to finish off her vlog while I'm doing my nails. So there's my nails done. They could be like a nicer shape, but I really need to try and like grow them out. But I feel like I'm definitely getting better at the whole nail painting thing. This hand still isn't ideal just because this is my, like this is the hand I used to write. So I find it easier to paint this hand than like use this hand to paint this hand. Okay, that was just confusing. But anyway, I was thinking a lot this morning about like, actually no, this, that's a complete lie. I was like, I looked in the mirror this morning and I was like, I do not miss being blonde at all like see when I dyed my hair back to brown I was like I'm gonna regret this like I know I'm just gonna want to go back to blonde like straight away and I honestly don't at all like not even slightly I think I don't know I just think the brown suits me so much better and now I see photos of when I was blonde I was like why did I think that was nice and I also just feel like my hair is so much healthier like I feel like it's also starting to like really grow as well like what do you see? You can sort of see it there. Oh, like it is quite forward on my back again. And when I was blonde, it just wasn't growing. Like my hair was completely dead. And it just feels, it feels thicker and healthier. And yeah, I'm loving it. By now, I really need to go and edit 
the vlog that's to go up tomorrow, so I'm gonna go do that now. guys uh today is wednesday and i'm really sad because today there's no high low this is my first because it was i don't think there was one last week no there wasn't but they had done their their like evening their christmas special live show so i had that to watch but this is the first week with no high low to watch so i might just have to go and watch an old episode but anyway um it's a really weird wednesday not having a high low it's really sad but anyway it is Wednesday morning and I'm sitting in my car ready to go to work. As you saw, I just time lost my makeup this morning. I just thought I would do that because that's my morning every morning and I've never actually filmed it for the vlog before. So I was like, do you know what? Let's just film it. Um, so I did that and then I was on stories talking about the rubbish this morning. I have decided to do polls on my stories. So if you don't follow me on Instagram and you want to get involved in the polls, feel free to head over there and follow me. Uh, literally just stupid would you rather polls, but they're fun. So yeah, I, I'm in work today, as I said, it's so weird. This is my second last day in work. Tomorrow's my last day in work of the year and then I'm working from home. So that's really strange. Like I genuinely cannot, like I cannot believe that it's 2021 in about two weeks. Isn't that so weird? I also bought Adam's Christmas presents last night. So I just need to get like a few wee things for my dad and then that's me sorted for Christmas. So that's good. That's nice to have that all like sorted and out of the way and not have to think about it anymore although they still do have to arrive so hopefully they won't be late to arrive but anyway yeah i do need to get ready to go i wanted to do my journal this morning but i got distracted by doing stories and now i have three minutes until i have to leave so yeah adam's also back in work today so i'm gonna make fun of him because <laughs> he's not on furlough anymore but yeah do you know what i think i might just quickly switch you off and do my journal very quickly okay so in the bottom of my journal i have this wee thing so it gives you ones that are all already filled in which are so we have gratitude love meditate and exercise and then i put in my go to read no meat no spam and be great because i'm really trying to be more outspoken and brave and more chatty with people in real life because i'm chatty on here and then i speak to people in real life and then i freeze and i don't know why i'm really trying to get over that because it's silly but anyway yeah i'm gonna fill in i just kind of use these wee highlighters from paper chase and just fill in each day so it goes monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday and it's a positive habit maker so i'm gonna fill in all the ones i did yesterday i'm so bad at reading like i i want to read so bad but i don't like i was so good at reading over lockdown like it is it and running are the two things that got me through lockdown i think they were like my two coping mechanisms and now that i'm back to real life i just can't read anymore i'm not too fussed about the exercise but um like i'm walking and stuff and that's enough for me in the winter like because it's cold outside and i couldn't be bothered with running and then the gym's obviously closed so i'm not too fussed about that i will get back to that when i when the time is right um but i'm really sad about the reading i really need to work on reading more yesterday was a no meat day so i'm quite proud of that i am trying to eat less meat if you've been watching any of my vlogs you'll know that like i'm not cutting it out completely because i've tried to do that before and it's just not realistic for me so the best thing for me to do right now is try to eat less meat so i did that yesterday no spend did not happen yesterday because i bought adam's christmas presents and then be brave i don't think i i don't think i was brave enough yesterday there were things that i scaredy catted myself out of that i shouldn't have so I'm not gonna fill that in. So the ones I filled in yesterday were no meat and exercise. I count my exercise as my, cause it's like a half an hour walk to work and that does me. Like that's an hour long walk a day. That is plenty of exercise. But now I'm going to put my shoes on and go to work because it is 47 and I like to leave at 45. Good evening. Whoa. You enjoy your McFlurry there? It's not great tonight. Is it not? No, it's very icy. Smooth. When I had my bite of it, I thought it was nice. Mm. 
Give us another bite. Is this even allowed? Don't know. Don't care. See, I like that. It's very icy. Like, I like it when it's a bit, like, harder. Because you know the way, like... Because that I feel like that's that's it fresh. Because when you get, like, a soft McFlurry, it's because it's, it's melted. Nice. No, I like it harder like that. <laughs> but anyway, good evening, guys. I haven't vlogged since I was about to go to work this morning. Just, I literally got in, made dinner. And then Adam arrived, and that was pretty much that. Yes. And I was saying you were back at work too. Oh, uh, yes. Did you have a lovely day? Yeah, phenomenal. I only cried like three times. Yeah, he went through his wee crying corner. Yeah, my rub. <laughs> it's in a corner. Hmm. You wonder? Sorry, I lift. Your lift? It's tagging on the ramp. Why? Oh, does it not? It doesn't ramp. You don't drive up it. No. <laughs> it doesn't ramp. Four legs on it when you lift it. I get it. So I watch. No, I didn't. I don't know if I mentioned in the vlog. Um, I definitely put it on my Instagram story. But today was like my first day of not having an, a Hilo, a brand new Hilo episode to listen to. So I went back and listened to like the most recent one that I hadn't listened to. Like, does that make sense? So I started yes. listening to it in about April. So I went and listened to the, like, the most recent episode before that. Yes. And they were talking, and it was so funny. It brought back like my memories of like the first ever episode I listened to. So the first ever episode I ever listened to, they were talking about Tiger King. Ugh. And they were talking about, um, I, mean, I actually remember exactly where I was when I was listening to it. Like see here in that episode, it really reminded me of it. So they were talking about how what do you call that actor? Nicholas Cage was going to act as the Tiger King. Yeah. And it's just reminded me of that. So basically in this episode that I was listening to today, they were talking about, they mentioned Tiger King, but one of them hadn't watched it yet. So they didn't talk about it. But yeah, it was just really funny. Cause it like properly brought me back to a time earlier this year. And it feels like ages ago. Still a program I have never watched. Same, no, I haven't watched watch it. it. There's so many things. Like, we still haven't watched that one with Sarah Paulson. Ratchet. Yeah. Still haven't watched that Don't F with Cats. Yeah, I'm watching that. Don't think I'll watch it either. I'm intrigued. All I ever heard was Sean talk about it. And then I was like, do you know what? You've told me so much about this. I don't want to watch it. I also want to watch The Crown. I'm so behind on pop culture in terms, like I'm not I'm not a good TV watcher. Vikings. No. I'm not a good TV watcher. Like I really yes. don't watch that much TV other than when I'm with you. Mm. Okay. But I want to keep up with it because I like being in the conversations. Like I like being able to have the conversations about what everyone's doing and what everyone's watching and what's like in pop culture at the minute, but I'm just so bad at keeping up with it. I just don't seem to have the time. No. Good show. Although I think a lot of people stay up really late to watch TV. Yeah, I do. And then get up. Like, I genuinely need my sleep. I am not good. No. I need to be in bed. I need to be asleep before, like, 11. When I'm working. I need sleep, but it doesn't matter whether I get six hours. 12 hours, I still feel like crap. I just don't know where people get the time to watch TV. I'll make the time. I suppose YouTube takes up quite a lot of my time. Yeah. Yeah. But anyway, I'm gonna enjoy my dad Coke. And... Dress for you guys a bit. Good evening, folks. It is now Thursday evening. I haven't been on the vlog at all today, actually. Because dad gave me a lift into work this morning, so I wasn't I didn't have my car time to introduce the vlog in the morning So it's now the evening and we've got our version burritos Adam picked me up from work because as I said earlier tonight We're going skating for like probably the first and probably last time in a long time So yeah, we were in a bit of a rush because the skating session Starts at seven and then ends at half eight. So you only have an hour and a half So normally we wouldn't be getting there until about eight if we left from home so we needed to be efficient and quick. So how are you? This is not wrapped well. Is it not? No. 
I thought that was treats through there. I was like, have they given me your meat? <laughs> but yeah, today is my last day in work. Um, for the next couple of weeks, I'll be working from home, which is kind of exciting and kind of scary. But anyway, I highly doubt you want to watch this evening. So, I'm just going to sit a bit of tortilla. It's half held together and it is. Yeah. And then we're going to go skating. So we are just out of skating. Did you have a good evening skating? It was fun. First time back in a while and probably last time back in a while. Yeah. Because apparently it's gonna be a six week lockdown. You dropped your Yeah, apparently it's gonna be thank you. Six week lockdown from Boxing Day. So that's fun. We could book in for like next Wednesday or something. Uh, possibly. Just to get one last session in before it closes. Yeah. Now we've come to the wonderful Al Gelato. This is a local gelato shop. It just wants to focus on your face. Yep, Al it's Gelato. Worth focusing on. And it's so good, isn't it? It's like proper Italian gelato. Yeah, it's just no bad. So I got ricotta and salted caramel. I got a ricotta flavour last time and the ricotta was really strong. Like it tasted really cheesy. Mm. So I wasn't a big fan, but it's actually so that's why I was saying should I get that? But it's actually really nice this time. I don't know whether the caramel like balances it out. And the is not sure. maybe. Ferrero Rocher. Uh with biscoff sauce and white chocolate flakes. What do you get? Honeycomb uh kind of butter. Oh, look, I've got a big Ferrero Rocher in here. Oh, right. Look. Let's see if you can see it. Like right there. You can't really see it, but there's a big Ferrero Rocher. And I can't lift it out or the ice cream will come out. We were going to go to Mods and get hot chocolate. But I sort of feel like my t my tummy needed something to calm it after Boojum. Like, I love Boojum. But I kind of find after you eat it, look, there's a big fur Roshi. Yeah, sometimes after you eat it, would you like this? No, no way. Your stomach can feel like really acidic or something, like really fiery. Like there's a fire going on down there. So ice cream just really calms your stomach after boozing. Ferrero Rochers are such like a Christmas thing, aren't they? Like, I'm pretty sure they're out all year. Like a Terry Chocolate Orange. But nobody buys them until it's Christmas. Can you buy Terry Chocolate Orange all year? Oh. oh. Maybe the mini bits. Maybe. I'm not sure. I feel like though, in this day and well, age. I suppose my uncle just bought a Terry Chocolate Orange for one. Yeah, so, but yeah. it's Christmas. Oh, yeah. <laughs> In my head, I just went, that's an Easter thing. Sure the mini eggs are already in the shop? That's not talking about that. Have you seen the mini egg bar? No. It's like a chocolate bar with mini eggs in it. You know, like the Smarties bar. It's like that, but mini eggs. They have them in greens in this burn. I saw it there. Mm. I, yeah, I feel like in this day and age, like, they should just release them all year round. Yeah, they would sell. Yeah. But then, but then the search that they do. And it wouldn't be as a special. But then Toblerones, they're in the shop all year long. Yeah. Toblerone. And people only get them at Christmas. Toblerone is great. There's a new Toblerone this year, isn't there? I don't know what flavour it is. Do you know what? I don't think I feel full. That was so more than arse the way I said that. I feel like full. I wonder what she's got. I don't think I feel like really full until I have enough to drink. Do you know what I mean? So I think I need to slow down while I'm eating. And like, drink. Because I think, sometimes I don't feel that full, like straight after I finished eating. And then like 20 minutes later, 
I feel really full. And I think, sometimes I think I'm still hungry but I'm actually thirsty. I think I'm just gonna bring this vlog to an end here because it was a Tuesday to Thursday vlog and it is currently two minutes past nine on a Thursday and I don't think we're really gonna do much of tonight. Probably just gonna go home to be honest. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit down this video massive thumbs up and subscribe because I'm uploading videos every day in December. I love you guys so much and I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video. Bye! Get out of my car. Damn, not you. Bye! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.